Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Mrs. Settemeyer's seventh grade Texas history class. Um, my name is Mrs. Settemeyer, and as you can tell, you are watching a video welcoming you to my class. I have been out of town, out of the country, since um, August 15th, and I will come, I will be back in the country on August 26th. I have been in South Africa doing a great white cage dive. Um, in Cape Town. Um, I have gone to um, False Bay, Mossel Bay, um, Gons Bay, um, and Simon's Town. I've stayed in Simon's Town, which is in False Bay, which is, or on False Bay, which also includes um, Gons Bay. And I am fulfilling one of my lifelong dreams. I have been doing some cage dives to um, ex to get to see great whites and other animals in their natural habitat. Um, I, if you've not checked out my website yet and been following my blog, please go look at it and see what I've been doing and what I, what it's been like for me. Um, you can find that on my homepage on my tech, my teacher website. Um, this year in Texas history, we are going to cover everything from the natives and the natural land all the way up to current times. Um, a few requirements for this semester, for this school year, I guess I should say, we will be doing an interactive notebook and you will need to have a um, binder, which has, or not a binder, a folder, which has the brads in it for you to, um, put your, um, to create your interactive notebook, you will need a ruler with a, that is like a three hole, hole punch. You can hole punch like two or three sheets um, to help make um, transitions easier. You will also need colored pencils, um, pens, preferably blue or black. You can have red if you want, uh, as well as, what else is listed on your supply list. Please read over the welcome letter and um, see what you need and what you're gonna be required to do this year. Um, teacher website will be a requirement. You will need to check that every day. If you are absent, you will need to look and see, what did we do? What did we miss? What are my warm ups? Um, the daily agenda is posted up there as well as a calendar showing the whole week. Uh, we also will be doing several projects. We'll be doing PBLs as well as individual projects, but um, that won't start for a couple more weeks. We also this year will be looking at, and I just blanked. Um, sorry about that. I know it's only like morning, noon, morning, afternoon, your time, but it's evening time, bedtime for me, um, depending on which class you're seeing this in. South Africa is seven hours ahead. So, you know, 12 year time, seven o'clock um, South African time. So I've had to readjust my sleeping schedule I'm getting up early. We're watching the sunrise essentially from the boats. Um, on the cage dive, we've been, I've already seen, I have not seen a great white, but this is only Saturday. It's my second dive. Um, but I have seen a beautiful seven gilled um, cow shark, which I didn't even know existed. So that was really cool. I got to learn something new. I've been learning a lot of new things while I've been here. Um, so that's been really, really um, enlightening for me as a teacher and just personally. Um, let me tell you a little bit about myself. I'm married. I have two cats, a 45 gallon fish tank. I feed and take, I feed a bunch of animals in my backyard. I have five bunny rabbits, um, Cadbury, Thumper, George and Reba and Captain Jack 
and Captain Jack is interesting. He's got a split ear, so it looks like he has three ears. Um, it's like a three-eared rabbit, and so I thought, you know, pirate name sounded kind of cool. Um, I have several squirrels, four or five hummingbirds, a lot of different types of birds, doves, blue jays, um, wood, I have a woodpecker, we have an owl. I've heard it, I haven't seen it, but um, neighbors have seen it, so I know it's there. Um, I also have cardinals, which um, is really cool to see. And I've been learning new things about um, some of the other birds um, in the area. Personally, I love reading and watching TV and um, doing Renaissance fairs and hanging out with my friends. And I'm very eclectic. I like a lot of different things. Um, I like Star Wars, you know, and then I also like Lord of the Rings. So I am a, I'm a very diverse person and what I like, what I listen to um, in music. Um, Texas Bobcat Cats are my football team. Go Bobcats! Go Bobcats! Yes, I believe maroon and gold. Texas State, not Texas A&M. Get that straight. I am a Cowboys fan, Dallas Cowboys, um, and a Spurs fan. Um... On Saturdays, I live for college football. I get angry when like, I wake up and there's not a football game on when I wake up at nine o'clock in the morning and I have to wait till 11. <sighs> Who does that? I know it doesn't revolve around me, even though it really does. Um, I look forward to seeing all of you and meeting you when I come back. I plan on being back at school on August 28th. Um, so that's the Monday we all, you know, after the first week. And I hope to have more to share and more to see, uh, more to show you. Please, please, please check out my website. Make sure you read um, the welcome letter and pay attention to the supplies you need. Supplies will be due Monday, May 28th. Um, but make sure, you know, bring pen and pencils to class with some paper because you're going to be doing some activities over the next couple of days um, to get you started into the new year. I hope everyone had a fantastic summer and I look forward to seeing you all. Have a great rest of the week.